Hello everybody, this is Magical Witch and I am here to show you guys more spells to do at home. This spell is a Call Me spell. Um, very simple, very easy, but very, very effective if you do it exactly how I show you guys, okay? What you're going to need for this spell is your cell phone, okay? Your cell phone. You're going to need your cell phone. Okay, you're going to need sugar, you're going to need cinnamon, you're going to need a piece of white clear paper with nothing on it, you're going to need a red pen or a red marker, and you're going to need a clear cup like this with water. That's all you're going to need for this spell, okay? The first thing we want to do is... We are going to cut the edges of your petition paper, okay? Because this is putting energy into your spell, okay? And this spell, you don't need a candle, just your energy, okay? All right, now, you're going to rub your petition, putting your energy into this, okay? And you are going to put the person's full name and date of birth, okay? So I'm going to use John Doe and his birthday, January 6, 1997, okay? The person's full name and date of birth. If you don't know the date of birth, you cannot do this spell, okay? You need the date of birth. Then... Underneath their name, you are going to put their phone number. So I'm just going to put 580-297-6424 because we are in the United States, okay? If you want to put the area code, you can do that as well. So 1508, if you live in the U.S., you put the whole number, okay? If you don't have the number of the target, then you cannot do this spell. It will not work for you. You need to know the phone number of this person. This person's phone number and their full name and date of birth, okay? Now, what you're gonna do is that you're gonna fold this towards you three times. One, turn it to your right. Two, turn it to your right. Three. Okay, you're going to take your cup and very gently, don't just don't throw it in there, very gently, you are going to simply put it nice and slow inside your water. Okay, nice and slow. Now, you're going to rub your hands, put in your energy because the water and the cup has to grab your energy. And as you're doing this, you're visualizing this person calling you, unblocking you, messaging you. And at all times, while you're doing this spell, your phone has to be right next to the spell, okay? Your phone has to be um, here, present into the spell. So right now, you have your phone right here, you're doing all of this, you wrote the paper, and your phone is, is at all times next to the cup, okay? So you're putting all your energy, visualizing this person unblocking you on social media. This person is going to be calling you. You're going to see the person's name on your phone. You're going to see the person's name when they message you. you visualizing this, okay? You're taking a moment and putting all your energy, and you're visualizing this happening in the present tense, okay? After you do that, you are going to now grab your sugar. Now your sugar, if you are a right hand, if you're right handed, then you're going to be using your left hand to grab the sugar. If you are left handed, you're going to be grabbing the sugar with your right hand. So I am a right hand, so I'm not going to be grabbing the sugar with my right hand. I'm going to grab the sugar with my left hand. And as you grab a pinch of this, you are going to be making a cross, okay, like this. 
okay across all right so it's across sugar going this way sugar going that way all right now i am going to take my cinnamon and i'm going to do the same thing i'm going to be using my left hand to do this because i am a righty so it has to be the opposite doing across as well one and two okay now this is when you rub your hands you take a moment and you start speaking your intentions all right grabbing your cup grabbing it speaking your intentions john doe you will call me john doe you will call me john doe you will call me you will block me off of social media you will call me you will reach out to me you will talk to me you will message me you will unblock me we will reconcile with each other and then while this is going see the cinnamon the person could be thinking about you the person is going to be reaching out to you but the person could be thinking about you desiring you and sexually wise okay um they could be thinking about you being sweeter like oh my god i need to see her i need to call her i need to hear her voice that's what this is for okay it makes them um wanting to call you wanting to reach out to you but very very important you cannot be in a desk you cannot be desperate okay you cannot be oh my god when is he gonna call me call me call me call me call me please call me call me call me call me call me please oh my god unblock me no 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 you're gonna be calm you're gonna be calm okay you are not gonna do that all right simply visualize looking watching this person looking at your phone and seeing that person's name calling you the person's messaging you reaching out to you that's what you're going to be thinking about okay after you do that now what you're going to do is you are going to simply leave the phone like this wherever you go the cup and the phone goes with you. So let's for say, um, you're going to the kitchen. You take your cup and your phone, put it on the counter and do what you gotta do if you're cooking, whatever, whatever, boom, your cup is there with your phone, okay? If you have to go to the bathroom, the same thing. <laughs> put it down together like this, use the bathroom. If you're going to go to bed, put it in your nightstand right next to your bed, okay? This has to follow you. Now, let's first say you have to go to work or you have to leave the house to do, you know, any any grocery, sh uh, grocery shopping or anything like that. Then you can simply leave the cup alone in a safe place where no one touches it. Take your phone with you. When you come back, you do the same thing until the person reaches out. When the person reaches out, when that person calls you, reaches out to you, okay? You're going to simply take the piece of paper. This, you can dump it, flush it down the toilet, okay? The paper, you are going to let this air dry, okay? Let it dry up. Don't try to dry it up. Let it dry up on its own, okay? Once this air dries, you are going to keep this always, always with you, okay? And if you need to repeat the spell again, this is already charged up, okay? You don't have to do this again. All you need to do is place the paper inside the water, then you add your sugar and whatever it is that I showed you, sugar and cinnamon, okay? Do this exactly how I show you guys, and you will see, all right, that this will manifest. Have faith, believe in what you're doing. Be patient, okay? And you will get the results that you want, all right? 
I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please hit that like button, share, and subscribe. Those of you who are interested in any of my spells, you can reach me at magicalwitch777 at gmail.com. That is magicalwitch777 at gmail.com. Blessed be everybody. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.